The U.S. Department of Labor is once again criticizing a new Iowa law expanding youth employment. The department said in a letter to the state, certain provisions appear to be inconsistent with federal child labor laws. Local 5's Larissa Leone spoke with politicians on both sides of the aisle on the potential future of this law. Stephanie, the law was signed by Governor Kim Reynolds in late May. It was designed to let some teenagers work in restricted industries like manufacturing as long as it's part of a work-based program. The U.S. Department of Labor told Democrat legislators before the law passed that an early version of the bill could violate federal child labor regulations. Now the law is on the books and the department is once again letting their concerns be known. The recently enacted Iowa labor law now allows teenagers to work in some specific trades, but the U.S. Department of Labor says some of these could violate federal law. We've heard directly from the federal government who is in charge with enforcing these federal regulations and keeping children safe in our workplaces that Iowa statute no longer has compliance with federal standards. And that's particularly uh, concerning when it's a brand new statute. That's Senator Nate Bolton. He was one of the state's Democrat legislators who first showed concern for the law. The department sent him a letter taking issue with a section of the law that allows 16 and 17 year olds to work in hazardous occupations as long as they are doing so through an educational or work based learning program. Under federal law, teenagers cannot legally manufacture brick, tile or related products, work in wrecking, demolition or ship breaking operations, operate power driven hoisting apparatuses or bakery machines, no matter the circumstances. There are real concerns here. We're talking about children operating heavy machinery that would be allowed under the guise of an internship. Just because you put apprentice or intern in front of a position doesn't make it safe. We reached out to Governor Reynolds about the concerns brought forward by the DOL. Her office said, quote, Iowa is one of 21 states across the nation, including Illinois and Minnesota, with employment laws related to minors that don't comply with federal law. Unlike Washington, D.C., here in Iowa, we believe in the dignity of work and want to instill those values in the next generation. Regardless, Bolton says officials need to clear up where the guidelines actually lay. The first thing the state needs to do is put out meaningful guidance to employers, um, having workforce development and the, and the labor commissioner work together to let employers know that this conflict in law does exist. Please don't violate federal and state uh, labor regulations. At this time, no one I spoke to has given any indication as to what will happen next with the law. As it stands, the Department of Labor and Governor Reynolds can only debate whether or not the expansion of youth employment goes against federal law. We reached out to the U.S. Department of Labor and the Iowa Commissioner of Labor and have yet to receive a response.